It's time for Money Monday with David Seeger from Great Lakes Credit Union, and we are talking today about credit scores. Good morning, David. Good nice morning. to see you. Now, basically, just basically give us a general definition of what your credit score is. Well, your credit score is a mathematical expression of your credit worthiness, and that is derived from your credit bureau report. Okay, he's so great. Well, it, <laughs> it makes a huge difference mm -hmm. in just about everything you do for any large purchases because if you don't have a credit, credit score, it doesn't seem fair, but you're going to pay more. That's right, exactly. It actually, it has an impact on your auto insurance as well. Right. What um, FICO, that basically, when you think of credit, you know, you think that's my FICO credit score. Uh -huh. What does that stand for? FICO stands for Fair Isaac Company. And that's how they got the word FICO. And, and the acronym FICO then is, is been tied to credit scores thereafter. Okay, okay. Um, major factors of determining the credit score. What, when they're looking at you and they're thinking, I don't know if this person can pay this back, what are the major factors? Well, the doing? major factor is paying your bills on time. That is the, 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 the biggest one. Okay. The other things like aging of credit as well. They look at your older credit that you have as compared to your newer credit as a predictor of you paying your bills on time in the future. So they look at time. a trend? Yes, they do. Oh, very that's much so. important. Then they look at types of credit. Is it revolving credit like a credit card? Or is it an installment loan like a, a house payment or a car loan? And those type of things add up to the credit score. Okay, now right now the U.S. average credit score is 692. That's correct. A year ago it was 666, which I think is kind of funny. <laughs> <laughs> um, the improvement, what do, where do you, why do we see that improvement? A right more now? improving economy, uh, things of that nature. Uh, people that have charged off some of their, their bad debt, paying down their debt, all that stuff adds up to a, an improving credit score in general. What can you do in the short term to improve your credit score? I mean, can it be improved in, the mat in a matter of six months, or does it take uh, years of uh, tracking to... It, it takes some time, okay. and um, once you screwed up your credit, it is a problem to try to get back on tracking, and like anything mm -hmm. else in life. Things to do, pay it, uh, your, 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 debt, your, your creditors off, um, if you had a, a, a slow pay with them, get them up to date, and keep them up to date. That is the biggest thing that you can do. And how long will it take once you get underway with uh, being up to date with everything? Does it take a matter of years for, before you'll see your numbers rise from, say, a 629 to a 699? There's no formula as such, but anecdotally what I have seen is that I've seen some people uh, file bankruptcy nine months later get a 700 score. Wow. And hmm. so it can improve pretty quickly. I know that's anecdotal, but also um, other people take a little bit longer. There's no rhyme or, or, or reason for it. We don't know exactly how they figure the score to begin with. All gotcha. right. Now, everybody is entitled to one free credit report a year, correct? That's correct. All right. And the website we have right here, is this, is this the right website? That's the right An one. Annualcreditreport.com. And so you just go in here. How are you able to get it for free? You just fill out well, yes, basic you, information with your social security exactly, number? Exactly. Yeah. This, okay. this one was mandated by the government with some of the reforms that went through and uh, they say okay Mr. Credit Bureau you have to give everyone a free credit report at least once per year and this is the the website you should go to to get that annualcreditreport.com yeah, that's the one okay. not the others but this one all right and I, I will also have this um, on northwestohio.com all of this information some really interesting facts that you've provided here um, another website that you can get a free credit score um, is creditkarma.com? Exactly. And that's anytime? Anytime. anytime. And that's an approximation okay. of which your score would be your FICO score. Down here as well. Um, what are the average scores in like the state of Ohio right now? 690, 688 for Michigan. So it's really close to the national average. Okay. What's the top credit score? Top score is 850. Gotcha. 300 to 850 is the range. Okay. All right. It's such, it's such important stuff to think about. Exactly. And of course, you don't really think about it until you're going to apply for a loan. And, you know, so thank you so much, David. Right. David will be back in the next hour. We'll talk more about this. Thanks. We're doing now more Money Monday with David Seeger from Great Lakes Credit Union. And we are talking about credit scores today. David, good to see you good again. Morning. Now, um, let's talk about just the basics of a credit score definition. What all does that entail? Well, a credit score is a mathematical calculation of your credit worthiness based upon your credit report. Okay, and FICO is basically, that is a credit score. I think sometimes people think that that's something different. Right, it's called the FICO score. Okay. It, the FICO is derived from Fair Isaac Company, which is the company that came up with the whole idea of the credit score to begin with. Okay. And it's a mystery how it's compiled. Yes, that's right. Trade right. secret, they won't right. tell. Right. Oh. All right, so right now, the average credit score in the United States is 692. Correct. But the median FICO score is 723. 
Can you explain that? Exactly. Well, a median score is that 50% of the scores are above that and 50% are below that. So with an average score of 692, mm -hmm. it shows you there's a lot of people in the lower end as compared to the higher end. Hmm. So that's not good news. But I will say, a year ago, it was 666, which is kind of funny, 666. Um, so it is improving. It is improving. It, that's Due to a better, better economy, more people going back to work, one way or another, yes. Okay. Um, in Ohio, the average score right now. 690. Um, and Michigan is it's, 688. That is correct. Kind of below. Okay. That's I mean, right there, right in the middle. Exactly. Um, we also want to talk, uh, talk a little bit about um, if, if your credit score is bad right now, what can we do? What can you do to improve it? What are the, I'm sure there's a lot of little things, and right. again, it's a secret of the credit score, you know, how they're determined, but what are some things you can do to improve it? Number one, pay your bills on time to help you m maintain a good score. Mm -hmm. But if you have bad credit already, try to make arrangements to pay off your bad credit with your creditor and then work on paying your recipe bills on a timely basis. A lot of people are behind on a lot of bills. Do you want to knock out the biggest, uh, biggest items or the smallest items first to get them off the plate? I'll do, do the biggest to smallest. You That's, go biggest to yes, smallest? Yes, I would, exactly. Okay. And the creditors look at it a little bit differently that way. Okay, those are the big ticket items. How are you paying them? So that's probably your best benefit. How long will it take for a score to improve dramatically if you have had bad credit in the past and you've finally caught up or just about there and you're about to uh, be able to make your payments on exactly. time? Exactly. I've, se I've seen um, somebody file bankruptcy and then nine months later have a score over 700. So that it, it's, it's different for everybody um, because we don't know exactly how to calculate the score, but fundamentally, I've seen some move that quickly. All right, real quick, we want to touch upon this. There's two websites, annualcreditreport.com. Now, this is where you can go once a year and get a free credit yes, report. Yes, and this, it is a free one. It's mandated by Congress, and this is where you go to get that. Okay, and again, that's annualcreditreport.com. We will put that information on our website. And then the other one is... Um, the, you can also go to creditkarma.com. Is that Credit Karma gives you an, a, uh, your credit score on there? And is this a once a year thing, or you can go as you want? Oh, right. okay. It's as many times you want, it's an estimate. That's right. It's an estimate. Okay. Okay. Such good information. I'm going to put. And what would you consider good credit? I mean, where you're going to get a good rate if you go to get an auto loan or something yeah. like that? As close to 700 as possible. That's okay. what you want to aim for. All right. All right. That's important. I'm going to put all of these. He has a lot of great stats here. I'm going to put them on our website on northwestohio.com. Thanks so much, David. You always have such great information.